We began our journey sometime in 1973, and gradually this Cosmos group, uh, this conglomerate, which is very well known nationally and internationally. And today we can say that we are a market leader in, in oil and gas, uh, in power, in uh, media and telecom, and also in uh, aviation, instrumentation and automation. United News of Bangladesh, which is the uh, first computerized wire service in South Asia today, is a very well-known name in every household. We have brought the rural news in the front page of newspapers, and we have brought the opposite opinion also in the front page. And uh, we believe that there was a gap and there was a niche for UNB to come in and we have filled up that vacuum and we continue to play that role very faithfully. We are also um, the publisher uh, uh, of the highest circulated English language news weekly called Dhaka Courier. Uh, we just celebrated our 26th anniversary and we have a free website where you can access our website for both our news weekly and news agency free of cost and get all the news and information. Uh, we have also Cosmos Printing and Publishing, which specializes again in promoting books and publications on nature conservation, art, archaeology, and we have been able to produce some, uh, some world-class books. We've been involved in many uh, projects like uh, promoting art. We have the Gallery Cosmos and we also have um, Atelier 71, a printmaking studio. I think we have the highest number of educational trusts, ranging from journalism to science, uh, fine arts, architecture, defense studies. We are also involved in promoting nature conservation. I also happen to be the chairman of the Wildlife Trust of Bangladesh, and we are doing a lot of biodiversity studies. We are doing a lot of projects to conserve the tigers, which is now a very threatened species. Uh, in Bangladesh and globally. We also promote mountaining and trekking and, uh, and, and some of our trekkers have conquered uh, you know, as high as third highest peak in Everest. Look at all the segments of business. I think we could be very proud that we are in businesses where we add value. We bring in new technology, be it in media or in energy or in telecom.